Hi, my name is Mininori, and I'm going to make my first video of Legion TD2. This was originally made in uh, Warcraft 3, and then they had some iterations in StarCraft 2, but now they have their solo alpha in alpha right now. Um, and yeah, you can get it on Steam right now. It's only $20. It's an alpha. There's still a couple of things that are going on, but yeah. It's a fun game. I'm sorry if my voice is really bad right now, but I went to a concert yesterday and, um, yeah, my voice is all cracking up, so I'm drinking a lot, and it's 2.40 a.m. right now, and I'm making this video just because I finally got in one of the servers, and, uh, <clears throat> I felt like I should make a video right now, so let's make that video. Um, what I normally play is Forsaken. So, how I like to play this game is... Uh, I start off with a Butcher on the left side. Right here, and then I make one worker, and I instantly, instantly sell a snail. So, how do you play this game? Well, it's the fact that it's a tower defense. Second, you have to... Defeat waves, send units to your opponent, which your units are seen here. This is your, um, it's called a Mythium, which is your income that you get to send units. Which you can do right here. And they have all stats like HP, damage, impact, fortified. Impact is the damage type, fortified is the armor type. Income is how much you get. You can find that all right here. This is wave info. find my there we go so why would I buy a butcher a butcher has a value type of 150 butcher can defend versus a wave 1 and a wave 2 but just to be sure I always add something like a gargoyle or two gargoyles if I'm lucky I can send um, another snail before this wave ends and that means that I can get enough income to put two um, gargles down right now. He leaked a lot. I'm sending to. I'm getting received by blue, and I am sending to teal. Okay. Okay, I want to try to send that get a little bit more income. There we go. So this was wave one, and then it resets. We're at 100 gold. I could put down a gate guard, but I'm just not going to. Uh, I'm going to put down two gargoyles right there, and I have 12 gold left, so I can't really put down another bone warrior. Uh, bone warriors, you want to more put more to the back, right here, in a cross line. The only reason why I do that is because you upgrade them to archers, and archers are pretty strong um, I'm gonna have no problem defending this so I don't really have to check that I send towards teal so let's check what teal has right now teal only has a pyro which deals EOE damage if I'm correct uh, each attack is 50% plus 30 to fly to all nearby enemies so he's going to defend everything quite good It goes a little bit slower, but I'm going more for the slow type of game right here. Um, I'm gonna check what is my hoppers. I need 290, and I have 240. So what should I put down? I could put down another gargoyle. Um, or I could put down a... Well, let's put this down. Let's put a gate guard down. My uh, value is over what I need right now. So I'm going to be fine. Gate guards are pretty cool because they um, summon Chaos Hounds. So that's another unit that you get that will tank a good amount of uh, damage. He's taken a lot of damage. The reason why the Butcher is that good is because it has lifesteal. And you see the outer ring. 
and then you see the inner ring. The inner ring is the uh, sort of passive that it gives. So all the units in the passive ring, in the ring right now, are getting that lifesteal bonus. Quite good, quite interesting. Um... Uh, I'm going to put down one of those guys and I'm going to make another worker. Okay. I am going to send it was speed. I think it was too late. I'm sending to teal, right? Yeah. Oh, these, that thing is destroying. Okay, I have to go to my own type. Okay. Um, I'm gonna leak here. <laughs> um, yeah, this is this is not good. I'm gonna leak here. Oh, maybe I'm not. The the butcher is doing a really really good job. I'm not gonna leak. I'm not gonna leak. It's fine. to add that 128 gold so let's make a fire archer let's add another gargoyle right here uh, check in wave info 440 I need 540 right now and I'm at not doing that great uh, I'm gonna put down those guys I'll probably will be fine. Oh, this is wave 5. So every wave, every wave 5, 10, 15, they're boss waves. So that's Scorpion King, which is the boss. And I'm probably going to leak here because I didn't spend that much money on... Um, hmm. I don't know. If I can put down a Nightmare or something... Oh, wow. Okay, this went really fast. This is, this is a good way for me. Teal is still doing quite okay okay workers you can see workers here that's your income your medium and your uh, supply cap you still need to upgrade your supply cap this is how you buy workers so we're doing okay there's a leak so every time when there's a leak we get money we get like two gold per unit as you can see right here a unit dies that's one gold that's one gold we're getting it's another gold we're getting so anytime that your opponent leaks that six gold just for the boss, it's just extra money just for you, which is great. Which is great. I'm sorry I'm recording this video with a really, my throat is really bad right now. So I'm I'm apologizing right now. I'm so sorry. You guys have to hear this. Um, I am going to upgrade one of these. I'm going to put one of those again. So this is green devil this has more upgrade i'm gonna check what it does it has 50 reduced damage and a lacerate each attack amplifies damage taken by two percent stacking up to nine times which is quite good uh normally you're not gonna have any problem with this They're having a problem, so if I send normally something quite big, I'm, I'm gonna be in a good shape. I'm gonna send something quite big soon. Um, probably going to send one of these that ups my income. Oh, they're leaking a lot. They are leaking a lot, which is a good thing. Which is a really good thing and this guy is probably going to survive but that one guy isn't going to defend all of that um i put this down i need a little bit more income how is my income plus four plus three plus okay oh yeah give me the money So we're doing damage right now at their Earth King. Two 
200. Uh, could buy a Nightmare. Nightmares are quite good. If you could upgrade them, they're really strong. Um, let's put down a Nightmare. And I'll put down one of these. Not. Oh yeah, now I have to buy a cap, so I hope that at next level I can buy. Let's see our opponent right here. Yeah, we are we are destroying them. Uh, we are doing quite okay. Let's just check our opponent again. The uh, the safety mole has good ability. It does reduce damage and more reduced damage. So he's getting kind of destroyed right now. And I just cleaned my wave up, my wave up. So good. We have a safety mole in there. And that is the only wave that's going through. Sweet. I did a good push. So this is going quite okay. I'm gonna get some money off this. Maybe even the safety mole is just really, really strong. Got some money of that. Uh, can't really upgrade, I think. Nope, I have to wait. That's not that good. Hope I'm, I'm lucky. Come on. There we go. And I'm gonna upgrade the Harbinger. I have the most fighter value right now. They're just sending some snails, okay. So the Harbinger um, spawns a pack of uh, units, which is just three units. And uh, it will just tank up more units and it's, it's just going to be fine. I'm, I'm over killing right now. I'm gonna make another worker here. Um, add a snail because I want some extra income right now. Um, uh, we're doing good. This is looking like a fun, nice game already. Uh, I'm gonna start upgrading these. I'm gonna upgrade a second. I should upgrade this. I'm gonna upgrade one of these because I want my wall to be completed and then I can upgrade later I can go for a double ganger which is it deals more damage how faster it attacks so it's quite good to have one of them and having a second butcher somewhere right here or something or here and just great because it will just tank a good amount of units you want to have a tanking line you want to have your casters uh, close combat dudes in the middle and in the back you want to have your archers which I only have one archer right now which is not that great normally want to have four or five archers who can just shoot from the back and do free damage the whole time I'm just asking my team if they want to push at 10 something or they want to um, Throw out something later. Send it eleven. Okay. What do I want to send now? I don't know. Uh, to upgrade those, and I am going to technically do nothing, which is a bad idea. You don't really want to keep money up. I have to probably not going to have enough. Well, I send a dragon. That was my push. Although the granddaddy is, is a big spider and it deals a good amount of damage. So, yeah.
able to easily defend this. Yeah. Yeah, well, Granddaddy's doing a good job, I see. Holy hell, he was a pretty good one. Oh, he's leaking a little bit. 200 gold. I can get a Lord of Death, or I can upgrade my um, Nightmare. Let's see, can I upgrade my Nightmare? My two double ganger, which is quite strong. So I'm gonna do that, and I am going to put down another gargoyle. And the next plan is to get the butcher up, and if I'm lucky, can I? I can normally get like a lizard in. Um, yeah, I can get a lizard in. Go, that's 110 that I'm getting each round. Okay. See, this guy is, is, look at that, he is attacking super fast. Bam, 100 attack already, he's just really attacking real fast. And next to the, the, uh, the butcher right now, he is just gaining so much life. The butcher is dead right now, but still, I have a Harbringer, uh, the archers are in the back doing a good amount of job, and he's just picking guys off. Like, really, doppelganger, if you can get him, try to get him, it's really, really a good unit. Uh, I think... Well, Tilt survived. We survived pretty good, too. Hundred and ten gold. Can I upgrade? Yes, I can. So right now I should upgrading up or start being upgrading the gargoyles. I should get another um, guard gate guard up. Um, maybe I'm lucky. I need a lot more workers though. So. Uh, maybe gotta get the brute. Get one brood in, okay. Just want to get a brood in because it's a tanky dude. That's the head chef, which everybody allies get 300 plus 10 percent over three times, which is a good amount of healing that it gets, and it's just destroying things right now. Look at that, pretty easy rounds. Ooh, the mantises are doing a good job on him. And he leaked. Oh, that's great. Are other people leaking? Um, maybe he's gonna go down. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That one is leaking as well. So only blue with four units. Uh, ooh, there's the dragon turtle even up there. Okay. This is a good leak. We can get some money out of this. Uh, I think I want to get another worker here. How many workers do I have? Five workers. Kind of on the low side. I'd rather have a little bit more workers, but I mean, I'll make it work, I guess. So. What do I want? Upgrade those guys. Mm, don't really need that. I could send one snail. Get a little bit more extra income. There's a big chance we're gonna send here. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a safety mole in here, which I could lose this round. I could leak right now. The safety mole is really strong. I could okay this round. Because he's not in range, he's only in range of that type, and my units can go all the way around. 
but we're just taking double right now. I could be okay. I think I'm got an okay safety mode is dying pretty fast. I'm good. Okay, great. This is great. Uh, I'm getting a safety mole here. They leaked again. That guy is leaking and this guy is leaking as well. Uh, yeah, the safety mole as well. So that's kind of... Uh, he's going to be okay, my teammate. So that's good. Okay. Let's see how they are doing. Those are a lot of units. Holy hell. They're gonna take some more damage. So they're Titan, technically their hero, the Earth King, I'd say, is uh, taking damage right now. Which is fine. It's good, it's good. We're doing okay. I'm gonna have like 400-ish. Nice. So let's put down a Lord of... Yeah, I think I wanna put down an other... There we go. Let's put down a butcher here so they're technically overlapping and then I can upgrade this one and then I can upgrade it to Hades. Um Oh man, I didn't send anything. I should have sent it an extra guy. Uh that sucks. I should have sent it like a uh, safety mole. Plus, um, like a double brood or something. Technically, I would just send a double brood because it would help so much. Now, let's see how I am doing over here. Um, Hades, is Lord of Death, is doing a really good job. I'd say. Let's put down... Killer slugs, though. Ooh, they're leaking a lot. Uh, two units. Got some leaks, too, but we're, we are gonna be fine. Yeah, we're gonna be completely fine. Let's see how they are doing. They're gonna take a good amount of damage, but I don't think that it's going to end the game. Um. Some minor units in there, like some lizards. Just gonna send that. Get a little bit of extra income right there. There you go. And then I'm gonna upgrade Hades. Never had this unit before, so I have no idea. Some of it is an imp resource. Units have life steal. That's a lot of life steal. Let's just make those two here. Let's see what happens. I mean, I have to upgrade these. I still have to upgrade that one. Uh, I still have to upgrade this one. And I want to get an extra nightmare in there too somewhere. Um, just put that down. I think my count is quite high now. It's a boss. So I have a Hades. The mass lifesteal that's going on right now is quite strong. Holy hell. So how's my opponent doing? He's having some problems. Okay, having a Hades in there is really strong. Holy hell. I need to get a couple of extra Harbingers. Those are really good too. Because they can stun the target and they summon uh, units. And they leaked. He leaked pretty hard. Three of their team leaked. This guy is probably going to leak too. Yeah, he's gonna leak. Yep, this could be the end. 
this could be end, boys. People are saying GG. Um, I don't know. I don't know if this is going to be the end. No, it's not gonna be the end. Just four units or five units. It's not the end. He has a 23% HP. So, how are we going to do this? I'm going to upgrade this. I'm going to upgrade these. And I cannot upgrade that anymore. <laughs> uh, do I have Harbinger Doppelganger? Right here. I'm just going to go in a Harbinger. Okay. I think I'm good. I have 3,500. Okay. I have a good amount of units that I'm sending right now. On the first look, we're doing kind of okay. The archers are doing like some extra damage, but. We're kind of getting overwhelmed from the right side. Although our Hades is... Making imps. Hmm, this is interesting. Are we getting overrun here? Oh, oh, there's still a headshot in there. With some hounds who are taking, the, taking damage. Well, we're gonna be fine. I want to make nine workers here in total. Yeah, that's GG. That is a GG. Well, that was a fun game. That's technically the thing you want to do uh, in this game. I was already saying, well, goodbye, guys. Thank you for watching, but it didn't end yet. Okay. Holy hell. Um... Don't have time to get a pack leader, I guess. I'll have to do it like that. Yeah, we're keeping them nice in a cone. So that kind of works for us. Although we are dying pretty good here. Hmm. I think we're gonna be fine. Yeah, yellow has. A lot more hard ringers than us. Yeah, I leaked, but I mean it's fine. There you go. So that's the first game of Legion TD2. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I will make more videos of this, and I will upgrade more of these videos. Uh, thank you guys for watching. You guys can follow me on Twitter, which is twitter.com slash minionod. And you guys can follow me on twitch.tv slash minionod for more player unknown slash legion td2 gameplay or whatever. Thank you guys for playing. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys soon.